All right, I think we're just about ready here. Aside from my viewer not showing up. Oh, there it goes. Okay, well. Welcome to the stream. It's time once again for Final Fantasy XII. The Zodiac Age. I didn't know this game had auto saves. I guess that's part of the HD edition remaster. Anyway, we're back here in Bujerba, and we had some issues that we had to get resolved. I don't remember exactly the specific timetable. Maybe I do. Okay, so wait, uh, Nalbana, that's right, we were in the uh, dungeon in Nalbana, and we met Bosch, who is the supposed Kingslayer, but uh, upon meeting him and having him uh, tell us what actually happened, uh, he was framed by his brother, identical twin, and uh, unfortunately, he was placed in the dungeon, fated to die until he met up with uh, our random ragtag crew of Balthier, Fran, and Vaughn, and so we broke them out. Anyway, there was some stuff that happened, got out of the dungeon, found out that Pinello had been kidnapped by some bounty hunters that are after Balthier, and uh, they were holding her captive here in Bujerba, which is why we're here, but now we have other things that we need to do, which I don't remember the specific details on, but that's okay. At the moment, we need to attract the uh, attention of the Empire, so we'll be just shouting in front of people. I'm Captain Bosch von Rotzenberg of Dalmaska. All right, no one heeds the words. I think that's because he said it before in that area, but last time I started, it was, I don't know, he had like 7%. I'm Notoriety. Captain Bosch. No one heeds your words. Why is no one? No one is heeding me. I'm Captain Bosch. There we go. Two. Two ain't bad. I'm Captain Bosch. <laughs> Just one. All right. I see how this is gonna go. I'm the Bosch von Ronsenberg. Well, regardless, we're just gonna need to find groups of people and I'm Captain Bosch. Testify. Not so many people are all that gullible though, unfortunately. Ah, I seen some sour looking baga around. Rasslers like them shouldn't be let to roam the streets. Tis bad for our image, eh? Bosch lives! Wow. <laughs> the captain alive! Yet he was executed two years. What's that? Hold on. Made a rousing speech to the townsfolk and convinced them by screaming, I am Captain Bosch, yes. Anyway, what's this guy saying? Executed two years past for the slaying of the Dalmascan king. I heard the Marquis's words myself. Well, that guy was especially gullible. Don't listen to Ondor's lies. <laughs> That's just a general statement. Yeah, I don't think anyone heeded those words because nobody knows what in particular he's referencing. Don't listen to Ondor's lies. Yeah. Yeah, you might need some new material there, bud. Ah. I'm Captain Bosch von Ronsenberg of Dalmaska. Just one. What do you think you're doing, Padra? Spread any more vicious rumors and I'll have you arrested. Ah, okay. Man, he took it down quite a bit. I'm the Bosch von Ronsenberg. Hmm. I think it was just that law enforcer in particular. I'm Bosch von Ronsenberg. Captain Bosch von Ronsenberg? 
He's gone from this world, surely, Badra. The Marquis announced it himself. No. I'm Captain Bosch von Rotzenberg of Dalmaska. Seems like the Parisianas are like the ones. I gotta target these guys. Alright, so he said the same thing basically. These are the information keepers or whatever of the uh, area, so I guess it makes sense. Bosch lives! That if you can convince them, you get the you get the big dick points. Huh. And you are this Captain Rotzenberg? Forgive me, Bodger, but you seem a touch young. Still bought it though. I'm Captain Bosch von Rotzenberg of Dalmaska. No, oh, I think that one was a new one. Ah oh, well. I'm the Bosch von Rotzenberg. There we go. You boy, you will come with us. Oh. Got caught. This is the one, Havaro. Says he's Captain Bosch, he does. <laughs> he would sooner pass for the king. I knew he were no captain. That was a mean trick to be playing. <laughs> if a trickery it ended, it would end well enough. But why this boy? And why Captain Ronsenberg? An explanation is due, and I will hear it. The Empire's hounds grow passing bold indeed. A shame if they learnt the Marquis trafficked with the likes of you. Agents masquerading as guides a hideout at the back of a tavern? Not exactly earning high marks for originality, are we? Now you've done Wait. it! So Bash von Ronsenberg does yet live. Oh yes. Oh yes, and of course we met Lamont. Lamont really is all right. Who's not really Lamont? I didn't think I'd ever get to see him again. You will join him soon. And until then, I shall see that you are kept from harm. Thank you. I am troubled. The Rabanasta Imperial Guard appear to have overstepped their bounds. I intend to speak on this with the Consul. What? Vain Solidor, the Consul, is my brother. <gasps> the first duty of the Consul is to maintain order in Damasca. My brother... My brother is not one given to failure. Perhaps things aren't going as well as they might be, but give him a little time and he will put things to rights. Be not troubled. My brother is a remarkable man. He frightens me. So, Palmas, welcome to the stream. Best game? It's a good I'm one. I'm sorry. He is your brother. It's just, you don't understand how much we lost to the war. My friends, my parents. So you fear the Empire? Listen to me. The men of my family, we are taught to place the needs of others before those of our own. I will see that you are kept from harm. It is my duty to House Solidor. But how? How can I trust you? Because I give you my word. My brother would do no less. No. Don't speak for him so readily now. I knew there must be more to it, but to find you at the end of this tale? <laughs> ah, to see the Marquis's face when he learns of it. I should like nothing more. I would meet him and see for myself. How say you, my lord? There is little to be said. I shall arrange a meeting with the Marquis. We shall expect you at the estate. Also, I like this one, despite what some people said. Yeah, we touched on that, I think, when I first started uh, streaming this, but eh, there was there was mixed reception, let's say that, from 
various peoples when this game came out still kind of has a little bit of that. Uh, but I think ever since Zodiac Age came out, more people got to play it and there's more positive reception in general. I don't know that there's anything I want to do here necessarily. Yeah, I wonder if they got anything good. Oh, the flowering cactoid. That's the one I was talking about before. Bill's petitioner can be found at the following location. You must speak with the petitioner to formalize a contract. Where would that be? Ah, the Esther Sand. Oh, that guy. I don't remember that. He was the one sitting on the crates. Well, I think with all these, I might as well just accept them. I'll go talk with the people in due time. Oh, this one's in Boucherba. Fierce Oraxis running amok in the Lusu mines. We're too scared to go inside. Please come to our aid. I don't remember if this one's a pain in the ass or not. Let's see. They're right outside the mines. I wonder if I should do that. I feel like I can use a little bit of experience, especially considering somebody told me my characters were at low level. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, that's what happens when you just go around playing strictly the story, though. But, uh... No, I'm not too bothered about it. The only thing is I don't want to hit a wall necessarily and get to a point where I won't be able to progress without actually having leveled up a little bit. So maybe we could do a hunt. Actually, that is... Okay, I was going to say, considering that uh, I have a full party though... I probably should have looked at the name, huh? I guess I could talk to everybody. Sorry to defend the work mines. Many rocks dwell in Lusu, a very dangerous place. Thus, we are needed. You have the look of someone new. You would do well to hire us, should you wish to enter Lusu. Of course, not today, for the mines are closed. Oh. Okay. Alright. Sawbell. Acum. Okay. Mm -hmm. Street Vendor, Cartographer's Guilds. Oh, I guess I don't need anything from them. I already bought the mine map. Oh, you're Akum. Ka! You have looked at that board. You've seen my bill. And you have come to kill the Nidhogg. Yes, I have. Ah, what great fortune. Please listen. There have always been many Roxas. What you call fiends in Lusu. Held at bay by a... what? Paling? I don't know what that is, but the paling has fallen. Now it seems rather that some Mulka has broken it. And now something most terrible has come out. Yes, a Nidhogg, previously sleeping deep within the mines, has come to the surface. It is beyond even us Paravir guards to defeat it. Please, Badra, defeat this Nidhogg. Find it in the shaft split in two ahead. Our prayers go with you. All right. Now we'll give it a try. <laughs> From what I recall, there's some boss battles coming up anyway, and that's what's got me a bit worried. I remember some of the battles in this game being a little bit tough, uh, but most of that usually concerned some of the hunts um, and some of the late game bosses. I don't remember the beginning of the game being too, too difficult, but eh, you never know. I also remember fighting the bounty hunters. Uh, and I neglected to do that, so I don't know if that would have been of some benefit to me or not. thing. The slaven. Actually, let me slow it down. Yeah. Miss, A. Eh? Huh. Oh good. Everybody like back up though. Huh. 
That wasn't too bad. Oh, nice. I didn't even know you could get critical hits. Well, with the crossbow anyway. Usually that doesn't seem to be the case for ranged weapons. Vaughn oh. knocking it out of the park. Okay, so where the path splits in two, I don't know which particular path they might be talking about. I think they're both at level 10. Yep, so I can start switching out either one of those guys for Bosch. We could start doing some equal leveling. Uh, let me look at the clan primer here because I think it actually... Does it post it on the map? Yes, it does. Okay. Well, that's not too far. I was worried that it was going to be like way deep into the mines. Look at that strut. because I'm constantly missing hits, but... that gate down that way. I don't think, no, I, don't, I seem to remember there was a control panel, but it didn't actually do anything. So I don't know if that's for, like, later future explorations into the Lusu Mines, or if it, it's just there for decoration. traps. I mean, before I was running into them, they were in front of treasure chests, which is like, okay, fair enough, the chests are booby-trapped. I mean, not really, they just set the trust in, or the trap in front of the chests, but still, you can sort of buy it, but I feel like, I don't know, they just sort of pop up out of nowhere. It gets a little annoying. this way because I don't want to tango with too many things and that uh, big dino. Okay, let's see if I can immobilize this slaven.
Come on, give me a crit. I'm supposed to have more high potions than I do regular potions. I think there might be a couple enemies in the early parts of this area, but otherwise... Oh god, it's huge. Oh, Jesus. That was a lot of HP. Yeah, I don't think I'm quite ready for that one. Back of my mind, I was thinking... I remember this thing being a little bit tough. But, it was hard to say. But nah, it's pretty bad. Uh, we're gonna have to wait on that one, I think. here, see if there's anything I can add. Um, hmm, that's weird. Is that the same as that? Yeah, it is. I don't know. I just find it a little strange that uh, Time Mage uses heavy armor. Yeah. Okay, what do we got going on here? Number one. Guess we skipped that. <laughs> Fires of War. Each character can obtain up to three quickening licenses from those available on the board. Learn Fires of War? Yeah. Sure. Belthier has learned a new mist ability. I think that's sort of like our limit break or overdrive, or, you know, whatever you want to call it. The character cannot perform quickenings under the Mist command in the battle menu. Each character can learn up to three quickenings. Okay. Pretty good. Let's get another Gambit slot in there. Okay. Potion Storm HP. That sounds good to me. Remedies remove petrify, confuse, and oil. Remedies remove sleep, sap, mobilize, and disable. That sounds pretty damn handy. Phoenix Down restores more HP, sure. I guess Fran might be the de facto healer. MP after taking damage. That's a good one. Um. Strength up, defense and magic is just down. Ugh. Uh, I'm gonna go the Firefly to Fran, since she doesn't have anything at the moment. Maybe I could give. Oh, all right, he wouldn't have that. That might be later. I 
Yes. Oh, geez. Getting accessories three for Vaughn probably wasn't <laughs> the best thing. I was thinking I might use it, but... Uh, he seems to be losing health a lot faster than everybody else. Maybe that's due to the armor, but I think I'd rather not dock his defense at the moment. So far away that the sound effects don't make any noise. Oh yeah, I think Balthier's got a full drive. Or quickening bar, I don't know what want to call that. Here's the thing though, I don't know if there's any benefit to saving it over using it. I can give it a try, just to see what it looks like. Techniques. Where is it? Maybe I can't use it, I don't know. Oh, missed. All right. Please. I feel like there was supposed to be like button combos or something like that. Was that the R2 part? I don't know. Maybe I'm thinking of Aaron's uh, overdrives from 10. First aid. Ain't that great? story maybe hit up a couple shops first but it's not really much else to do we'll save though at least we got a little bit of experience okay so let's go ahead and so where to, ah, uh, there you go. Okay. Bizarre goods are available. You don't say, unassuming surcoat, simple surcoat stretched from choice pieces of leather. Interesting. Um, I guess I'll get that because I was looking to get in some potions anyway. Uh, chromed leathers, huh? What is this? Move slow and stop from one ally. Just don't petrify. I haven't come across any enemies that do any of these status effects, but hey, it wouldn't hurt, right? Actually, I did come across something that did silence. That was a bit of a pain. All right. Let me check 
something here. And bring out some windows. Or not. Also silenced everything, so that's cool. That works, though. Okay, so... I don't know what half of these markers mean. <laughs> what is the orange diamond? Is that just an item shop? Oh, it's gambits. Oh! Maybe I should look into this. So, targeted by an ally, not targeted by an ally. Targeting leader, furthest to nearest. That one might be handy. Highest MP, lowest MP. Highest max MP, highest strength. Highest speed. Oh boy. Oh, foe status. Actually, I need ally status for that. I was thinking that'd be a lot more handy. Okay. Um, lowest defense. Might try to cut it a little closer with the HP percentage, I don't know. These will probably be need to use uh, at a... Like, very specific instances. Like, if I come across a boss or I know something is gonna have a certain status effect to use. Oh man. Yeah, this is expensive. Oh no, and there's a self category too. Oh god. I don't think I'm just gonna have to settle for the ally. Hmm. Maybe I can sell some weapons and stuff. <laughs> yeah, selfie category? No. <laughs> I might do just that. Assassin's Dagger. Maybe Penelope can use that. I don't know. I mean, she's in the party eventually. I just don't remember at what point. Can anybody use that? Light Armor 2. I mean, you can use it, but it's not very good. Another headgear. Pinty hat. Nobody could use that right now. Hmm. I guess that put me pretty far ahead. Here, let's look at that leather headgear. Put it on both here. So I'm gonna buy something real quick. I tell you, getting this crap oriented is becoming a pain. I'm working with a second monitor, but it's like it always wants to pop up different windows. I 
I did it again. Let's see. I don't know how to make it stop. Oh well. This didn't happen with Okami yesterday. It's the first time using this system I've got going on and well, second time I guess since yesterday, but it uh it's not working as well as it did yesterday. Keeps wanting to pull up OBS, which I appreciate, but not necessarily something I need to be looking at. Percent Libra charge. What is this? Restores user MP. Technic fails. MP is reduced to zero. Oh, <laughs> that doesn't sound very good. No, I don't think I'll be purchasing that. Thank you. Anything else in this particular area? No. I do want to look at some armor. I don't remember if that's sold at the same place where the weapons are sold. I'm thinking maybe. <laughs> I don't know, sometimes Final Fantasy's got these weird systems when it comes to shops. No, no. But I could get a new gun. Avis killer. Boy, they're kind of expensive, though. Avis killer project can be equipped. All right, yeah, you can't equip weapons. At least not when you purchase them right away. I don't need you to advertise to me when I'm at the counter. Hmm, I guess I'll leave the rest of it alone for right now. I'm a little surprised there isn't an armor shop. Maybe it's inside something? That'd be kind of weird. Oh no, there it is. Never mind. Excuse me. Yes, I'm in need of many protectives. Uh oh. This might be a problem. Okay, well, I'm gonna go ahead and start selling some of this other stuff. I suppose... Uh, I'm just not gonna worry about it since a lot of this is early game stuff. Maybe it won't be that hard to come by. But I need the money. What you got? Tail of the Phoenix, two Phoenix Downs, matching pair of leather goods, guaranteeing comfort both in the bazaar and on the battlefield. Maybe not. <laughs> I got a feeling if these guys are already using like ring mail and all that. Okay, we got a horn hat, Bolero. Where's the heavy armor? I need that for Vaughn. I need heavy armor too. He doesn't have that? Maybe he didn't get it. Where was I looking at getting that? Well, I got it now. Get 
There we go. Okay. Ah, shit. Actually, I'm going to look at his techniques real quick. Um, shields, I don't need that. Okay, he's already got heavy armor too, that's good. Here, maybe I can give him that battle harness. Increases magic XP by 230. He has to take damage. Increased chance to block with the shield. I haven't really used them in battle all that much. Probably should. Okay, first let's get that scale armor on. Okay, sell the old crap, go back to getting some new crap. There we go. I might be able to buy one more thing, let's see. I guess the ring mail is the most important part. Horned hat, I'm gonna give that to Fran. So the head guard, and I think that's good. Everybody's kind of in a good position right now, so we should be all right. Now we've been expecting you, His Excellency the Marquis awaits. All right, take me to him. Uh, you're ready for your audi audience, audience, Badra, yes. I already said take me to him. I don't need, <laughs> like, double confirmation. His Excellency the Marquis is otherwise occupied until sunset. Please, I will show you to a place where you may wait in comfort. Ooh. Get a nice hotel or something. Sir Bosch von Ronsenberg, it was not so very long ago that I announced you had been executed. And that is the only reason I draw breath. So you are the sword he strung above my head. Vane has left not a thing to chance. And? A leader of the resistance has fallen into Imperial hands. A woman by the name of Amalia. I would rescue her, but I need your help. This resistance leader, this Amalia, she must be very important. You understand I have my position to consider. Would you let us see Larsa? He's got my friend with him. I'm afraid you're too late. Lord Larsa's cortege has already rejoined the Imperial Detachment. I am told they will depart for Rabanastar upon the arrival of the fleet this eventide. <sighs> Wait a second, I thought he was going to return her. to calm down. Captain Ronsenberg, surely the exigencies of position are not lost on you. Why, indeed, you should find the enemy's chains an easy burden to bear. Wait. Sorry, can't be helped. Summon the guard. What a bastard. Huh? They have to be doing? taken to Judge Those decrepit basking fools in Arcades tie my hands, and look what happens. I tell you, this country's obstinacy knows no bounds. 
The insurgents in Ravanasta operate alone at present. However, should they garner external support, the situation could worsen. We have found the counter-imperial elements in Bujerba to be conspicuously well-funded. No doubt Marquis Ondor is behind this. Ondor must be reined in. By the way, the Marquis has written us a letter. He claims that he's recaptured our runaway. He's given him to Guise. He will die by my hand. Your fraternity is moving. Ah! Guise returns with Larsa. Tomorrow morning they will leave Bujerba. See him home safely, Gabranth. Now I'm expecting Dr. Sid. You may leave. We must see the real thing, to be sure. Nabadis taught us much. Yes, it's well hidden. They'll be off chasing after shadows, the fools. Ah, yes. The reins of history back in the hands of man. Ah, Vane. You seem to be enjoying your job as consul. I was kept waiting fully two years. What news of Arcades? our honored members of the Senate. Hard at work, as always, trying to find a dagger for your back. Mm. <laughs> they are <laughs> welcome to try. I guess I don't really care. Ah, but Sid, the staple of all Final Fantasy, this one actually made it in. Of course, he plays one of the primary antagonists, and it's not a side character or supporting. my lord. <sighs> Majesty. After what you've done, how dare you? You're supposed to be dead. Come now, come now. Have you forgotten your manners? This is hardly the courtesy due the late Princess Ashelia Benagin Dalmasca. Princess? To be sure, she bears no proof of her former station, no different than any mean member of the insurgents. The Resistance. His Excellency the Consul asks the Ministry of the Disthroned Royal Family in restoring peace to Dalmasca. Those who foster instability and unrest who claim royal blood without proof, they shall meet their fate at the gallows. There are no exceptions. I will not play puppet to Vane. King Ramanas entrusted me with a task. Should the time come, he bade me give you something of great importance. It is your birthright, the Dusk Shard. It will warrant the quality of her blood. Only I know where to find it. Wait. You took my father's life. Why spare mine now? You would have me live in shame! If that is your duty, yes. Stop being so stubborn. Keep on like this and you're gonna get us all killed. Don't interrupt. What? Vaughn, that stone. Now, how did you grab that? It in the palace treasure. Well, well. Ha ha ha! Splendid! You brought the stone with you. This spares us a great deal of trouble. Don't give it to him! Uh. Uh. You have to promise. No executions. Hardly the in a position to barter. To the law. Take them away. My lord! Lady Ash is to be quartered separately. <sighs> 
Vain Solidor, what fascination does this hold for you? So, of course, that was the magicite that uh, Vaughn had got towards the beginning of the game. So you were carrying it all along, the fates jest. <sighs> Tell these fates of yours to leave me out. Keep quiet. There was nothing else that I could do. You know that. Oh, I understand. Honor, duty, and all that. I still can't believe that was what a princess. Keep quiet. <laughs> <laughs> Marquis has been busy. Not lightly did I beg his aid. Listen, it's been a full two years. I alone have kept her majesty safely hidden. I doubted friend and foe alike. I could trust nobody. You did your duty, and mine for me. I'm getting her out. I need your help. Of course. Oh. Vossler joins as a guest, and we have a map of the Leviathan. How handy. And they have a save crystal here. Um, I don't remember the ship being huge, but it's somewhat big. Not be able to leave this area easily. You may wish to save a game with a new file. Oh. Thank you for reminding me. I'll do just that. Okay, one sec. Out. And away. And, uh, let's take a look. Gotta lean up against my mic for a second. All right. I think I might... The solution. No, I don't. <laughs> In fact, that made things much worse. All right, well, whatever. <laughs> now I can't see anything. Well, as long as the stream is still working, I'll get this all figured out eventually. There, now the controller is not even on. Let's see about getting Bosch and the party. Slightly worrying, though, because I figured that the uh, guest party members are supposed to be in and around the same level as where your characters should be. And this guy's four Wait, levels ahead. A word of caution before we set out. See that red web of light spanning the passageway? It is a mechanism to detect intruders within the ship. Break one of those beams and an alarm will sound, summoning the guard. The alarm should cease after a time, but it's better to avoid drawing unnecessary attention. Come, Her Majesty awaits. What if I want to draw attention? Level up a little bit. <laughs> Let's see how bad things really get. Ah, oh, they sent the dogs. Oh god, uh, it's really just built up, didn't it? Yeah, let's use it on the Mastiff, why not? I never miss. Damn. Okay, I think I'm sort of getting the strategy here. 
you could sort of boost the attack, I guess, depending on certain attributes that you might potentially roll on. drops on yourself. Actually. Oh. He was purple, it seems suspicious, but uh, now he's just poisoned. Okay, so that was a little bit rough, but... Hey, at least we could come back here and use the save crystal, right? There we go. Even got rid of the status effect. Okay, so I'm probably not gonna do that too much, but at least we can get through here and fight a, a horde of enemies. I do remember there being a few pickups around here, so it might be a good idea to just kind of do a walkthrough. See if I can find anything of interest. worth it. <laughs> Just one potion? Come on. Where are they coming from? Here we go. Just one? They sent just one? sorts. Yeah, something like that. Can I really hit him from here? No. Oh. Oh, damn. Ready to the attack, but not necessarily hit them. Guess I should probably go after these guys, yeah? trying to beat your face in. Please. Didn't get it that time. What a shame, I got it last time, but it just a split second too late. So, I think what it does is it tacks on like an additional attack just for extra damage. Notice the one that has less HP. A little bit later than when I do my selection. Well, surely there's got to be things down here, right? Oh, look at that. It's a big pile of crap here. Golden Needle. Reflect a good moat. Got two of those. 
I wonder if there's an upcoming enemy. Well, I mean, we got the hoplites, but, uh, you know, like a boss that uses that. Insert access key. Oh. But boss that uses magic of some sort. Hmm. Well, let's take this guy out. <laughs> Slow turnaround. Mm -hmm. Guess that arrow didn't affect him too much. Okay, so we need to go oh, down to the bottom here. Go to that northern little exit. There we go. It's kind of weird that their security has got like... I mean, maybe not, but you need access keys for that, but... Not for any of these doors, apparently. <sighs> I'm just gonna go forward. Back through here, there's gotta be something interesting, right? Otherwise, I wouldn't be blocking it off. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I guess HP was getting a little low, but I didn't think that much. Let's try to prevent that from happening to both here. And Vossler. Actually, Vossler, you heal yourself. I'll try to get Fran back up. looking at the menu. on him, but I think he's one of the heaviest hitters at this point, so. Yeah, maybe it should. I wasn't 100% sure if status effects wore off as soon as an immediate battle was over, but it doesn't look like they do, so. What is going on here? What is with these windows? Look at that reflection. <laughs> I thought it was a video screen coming up to it, but it's just very awkward. I don't know, like a camera screen reflection. It's almost kind of freaky. There you go. Big ol' hit. Ah, shit. I don't know if that was timed or what. Maybe just come in this way as aids. Okay, so I'm kind of wondering here if we're gonna, one, run into a shop, probably not, and two, 
uh, if there's gonna be a save crystal up ahead. What is going on here? We need to go this way. Maybe that's the holding cell. Let's go this way first. Normally I'm a candidate to go where the game doesn't direct you, but I don't think we're looking to get up to a bridge area of sorts right this moment. Um, I'm gonna look at the gambits. Let's be 20%, go ahead and use a regular potion. Actually, you know what I haven't been seeing, and I think it's because my items are not sorted. Auto sort, there you go. Okay. So I'm gonna bring Vaughn back in just so we could level up evenly. Get that potion. Foe, party leader's target, that's fine. Uh, let's see. Let's do ally. Where's the other ally? Oh. Since we're running into so much poison, don't attack them, that would be stupid. Alright, go ahead and use antidote in that instance. Here's target nearest visible. No, 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 no. We don't need to do that. Let's do blind, since we've been getting a lot of that. And then... Eye drops. There we go. I haven't run into any other status effects, so I'm, I guess I'm not going to worry about any other thing. Let's see, there's visible. No, do party leaders target. I prefer that. Problem with Balthier is that his rate of attack is so slow. Here, I'm gonna give this to Bosch. Uh, ally status knocked out. There's Phoenix down. And whatever, I guess I don't really care about right now. Okay, so that should help out a little bit, but we need to change out the party. is a boss of sorts. Fear not just their more jerk offs. Take down the leaders and the others will follow. Fair enough. You can only use Libra on yourself? All right. These are like minor judges. I don't remember who I set the gambits to, so I don't know if they're going to be healing people or not. Oh, 
Oh. That was a big battle, I guess. Disobedient again. All right, whatever. There's no crystal in here, right? No. Well, damn. Also, I'm thinking with this, maybe I should just keep it at 30. 40 would be a good number, too. Ah, oh, look at that. this? It's not a map, is it? That is a system access key. Alright, so we can turn off the security systems. If we so desire. Alright, that works for me. I also have some imprisoned moogles here. I guess they'll serve as a shop. Oh, I thought his name was Lettuce. Koopa! Not a word from you, Koopo. I know why you've come. Oh, and thank you for opening the cell door, by the way. Most gracious of you. After this treatment, I think it's safe to say we won't be visiting any more Imperial warships in the near future. The road calls, Koopo. All right, Tetran Koopo. You don't look like any Imperial I've ever seen, Koopo. Me, Koopo? Koopo, I'm a, but a humble traveling merchant. As luck would have it, I happen to be traveling here. Would you like to see my wares? I'll warn you though, I only sell one of a, uh, wait, sell to one kind of customer, the paying kind, Koopo. Oh. I guess that'll exclude me. Man, I can't really afford anything though. It's got some nice stuff. That Zwill blade seems pretty nice. And the Vega, that's a new weapon. Oh, I get the crossbow. That'd be cool. Ah, oh, damn. It's not like I really, like these Imperials don't drop much. They drop a little bit of money, but. Let's see. I don't have that mass amount of high potions that I did either. I'm probably gonna be good with the amount of antidotes and eye jumps I have, but. Guess I can never be too sure. Boy, a white mage would be really handy. Wait a second, how much does a phoenix down cost? 200? Uh, didn't, didn't really save me any money. Any merchant worth his salt needs but one thing to do business. A customer, Koopo. Yeah. Alright, well, let's see, I can sell, man, I usually keep the uh, first weapons too. It's a good weapon, but I guess I'd rather have something else. I mean, the poison and sap, oh, that might be handy. Yeah, I don't really have anything else to sell. Okay, so I could either get the Zwill Blade, or I can get the Crossbow. Oh wait, no, I can't get the Crossbow, it's 1900. Zwill Blade it is then. I got seven guild in my name. 
fix that up real quick. Even though it doesn't look like there's anybody in here, we'll just open this up. Aren't you a little uh, short for a soldier? It's nothing. I'll be fine. Maybe not. Yeah. Actually, compared to Bosch. Come on, come on, let's go. What are you waiting for? Pinello's still out there. We should hurry. They won't be long. We will talk later. Ash joins the party. Yay. And not as a guest either. She is at level 11. Well, you know what? I don't know if, like, the mainstay party members are leveled to about your highest level, or if they're, like, level average to where you should be. Maybe Vossler's just beefier. Either way. Well, I guess I'll leave her out of the party, seeing as I bought gear for everybody else, and, you yeah, know, she's... A slightly higher level than everyone. Anyway, as we continue to see, there's still some more parallels between this game and uh, the original Star Wars. It's not like a one-one recreation or anything Majesty, like that. I'm just saying they're there. We will cut to your path. I will not place my trust in the sword of a traitor. Yet trust his sword, we must. Traitor or no. I see no other way. We track back. Commandeer a ship and make our escape. Now it's the prequels? <laughs> Where's Jar Jar? I don't know. Her Would that be Fran? Her cannot abide weakness, <laughs> least of all in herself. We must make her confront the reality of our plight. I guess she's not the comedic character, but she is like the alien one. But now we got our humble orphan child in Vaughn. Pinello is just kind of like a tack on. Uh, but we have our rebel princess in Ash. We've got our evil empire. We've got our Darth Vader in uh, Gabranth. And he's sort of spread out across everybody else too, all the other judges. ISDs are these juggernaut ships. Oh god, this might start getting complicated. Depending on how many enemies we have here. Okay, ah, go away. We were betrayed at the Sky City, the floating city in the clouds. But then it sort of wasn't like a full-on betrayal. But it had the appearance of one, that's the important thing. Oh, whoops. Bosch had the uh, Phoenix down. Well, don't worry about it. Go ahead and just start. There we go. Oh, wait. that gambit for using antidotes, but it ain't working so well. I mean, somebody very sneakily keeps hitting Vaughn. Like, I'm not seeing these hits. Maybe it's magic attacks. What the hell is that? That's a potion. Oh, he's already using it. There you go. Is there any end to these guys? Jesus.
Damn, I'm starting to uh, see the problem in not having the uh, backup attack nearest enemy because they're just not going to attack anything if the party leader is not attacking anything. some ass. It sort of sucks without having a magic caster to do, you know, some form of healing. Maybe, I wonder what... What is Ash doing right now? Nothing? Hmm... Well, then again, at the same time, I don't really have any magic. I suppose the Moogle was selling some, but I'd have to go all the way back. Physical attack damage, sure. If this should store more MP. Increases magic potency, and be good. I need, like, the good stuff. Where's the good stuff at? Where's magic one? Is that... Oh, yeah, okay, so that has cure. Hmm... How the hell do you get, like, this one? <laughs> what the hell is that? It's good that you can see what they are ahead of time, though. Oh yeah, that, that does not sound very good. Green magic. Okay, I'm not gonna worry about that for right now, um, because, well, I could put her in the party. Let me, let me hang on to the current crew for a sec, because we're right next to the security checkpoint. Well, good thing these replenish, I guess. Don't really need any of that, but... Okay, use the system access key. View security report. What does it say? Security report page one of two. Anomalous activity detected in brig number one. Level three shipwide alert is in place. Security report page two of two. Large freight stores. Nominal station use. Sub control room. Nominal. Let's reset that shit. Ponder setting will have 60 seconds in which to dispose of source of the anomaly. The alarm has been reset. If you do not dispose of the source of the anomaly within 60 seconds, the alarm will sound again. So what the hell does that mean for me? Because, like, I'm the anomaly, right? <laughs> yeah. Guess I have to self-terminate. Oh wait, I was supposed to go two over, not one. No, 
remember what hitting up the other one does. That just give me it, so it just gives me a minute of freedom. Hmm. Very strange. Okay, well, let's go through... I was thinking about going back to the Mughals, but if we gotta deal with, like, tons of troops in the meantime, I guess I don't want to. <laughs> so... We'll just keep pressing onward. Did I get a magic out of that? Sleeb. What's down here? Nothing? A door? I guess it's not really worth it. Maybe if I have no encounters then the alarm will be fine. I'd kind of like to just attack at my leisure, but I don't know if that's going to be... All right, now the alarm's just going off again. And they know exactly where I am. not just a potion, was it? like a major fight, but they're still being a pain in the ass. I'll just keep attacking them. Good. Turning the corner, he wasn't really going after anything. Routine patrol. And I just hate to potentially be passing up on anything. Especially if they're doling out like magic spells in these random uh, chests, but... What is this? some control room. Mm, these hoplites are a bit of a pain. Oh, 
So. I think Fran is supposed to be the one that does antidotes, but she doesn't feel like it, I guess. Potion yourself, hurry. It's better do it a second time. Fun. Is it finally over? Great, let's get this treasure. Vega and a potion. I don't know if that's the one that Balthier already had equipped. Oh, he's got the Capella. Ah, so this is the better one. Good thing I didn't buy it. Okay, I don't know. Vaughn's kind of sucking a little bit right now. Um, he is at level 11, though. So... I'm gonna swap him out for Ash. And then Ash, let's see what we can do for her. Um, is there a way to? There we go. Oh right, she's got light armor. So she's just stuck with that right now because that's her default. Well, that should be fine. <laughs> Hopefully. Shouldn't have any gambits though. HP 30%, do that. Nearest visible, I guess, is fine. Um. I'll just leave it at that. I'll baby her and choose her as the party lead for right now. Is there anything I need to do in here? There's a mechanism of some sort, which I figured, but I didn't, didn't see anything. Show me. Yes. This isn't a pr uh, it's just another 60 second one again. God damn it. So I need to go... Wait a second. Oh. No, I don't need to go this way. Damn. I'm going the wrong way the whole time. That doesn't go anywhere? <laughs> oh no. We had to go back to the entrance. I thought I had to get to, to the uh, central area here. Whoops. 
Oh well. we can go back, I guess, into the brig area and save. Refuel, as it were. What if we went back here and they just assumed that we were turning ourselves back in? Expect any more opposition? Okay, let's see if I got any money to uh, buy a thing. Yeah, she can still equip swords. I guess she has an inherent, like, Sword 2 mastery. Okay, well, I think at this point, armor might be a little bit more of an effective purchase, so I'm just gonna... There we are. Okay. Well... Let's go back through. More fun going through the alarm system ship. becoming a full-on, like, onslaught again. Ah, shit, I don't want to go that way. So, we're just gonna flee for right now. Fortunately, the party member left behind. Once we resurrect them, then they'll just pop up back where we left off. Oh! I didn't think Bosch could do it, but he did it. I already fought through a full wave of these guys first time around, so... I don't have any reservations about leaving it for a second run. I mean, aside from missing out on some experience, but I think I'm fine with that. Oh, no, you don't. No, we're not getting in a fight. Okay, fortunately, there's this thing here, so... Get 
60 seconds of potential peace. We need to go back up here, basically the way that we came through when we first got to this particular level. you've escaped you must hurry you are captain azalus you will follow me we must reach the airships before they do you would let us leave knowing who we are lady ash by all rights you ought not even to exist that you and captain ronsenberg were made to appear dead is like a hidden thread laid bare your actions hereafter will pull at that thread and we will see what it unravels this is our chance. We must see this through and get to the bottom of it. I believe tis for the good of Dalmasca and the good of the Empire. Very well then. Thanks, Lamont. <laughs> uh, I must apologize. Hmm. Penelo, for you. May it bring you good fortune. Thanks. Let us go. Well, all right. I guess we got Pinello. It's not really a replacement for Fossler, but that's fine. And we got the manufactured Nethysite. It's not as good as the Magisite, but it's fine. Look at all these items just hanging out here. Confess, I thought you the one who would help us restore peace to Dalmasca. No matter, we hold the proof of your royal lineage. A maid of passing resemblance will serve our purposes now. As for you, my dear, the Empire requires you no more! <sighs> what was that? Uh -huh. The Nethysite. <sighs> your Majesty does not disappoint. Ever quick to spurn an honorable surrender, as was your father. You know nothing of my father! That's right. Uh, okay, so... I feel like we should probably take out these guys first, yes. Unless they just keep coming through. Then that would suck. here in here so we could have used his quickening but that's okay
Ooh, that sucks. Okay, I have enough potions to get us through without having to, uh... Oh boy. Use heal, I think, so I'm gonna do the Reflectiga. Um, because that magic bullshit was... Yeah, I didn't like that. Got other things here too. Deal dark damage to all foes in range. Let's see what that does. We actually did some decent damage. Does he have anything? He's got protect on. So we could dispel that. Let's get this greater barrier on. Did he just kill himself? I think he just killed himself. Nice. That's what you get for using magic, old man. See your face. We've secured an Atomos. Come. An Atomos? All skiff, no ship. Hardly fit for a leading man. <laughs> So I can fly it then? You're mad. Oh. <laughs> He's up there, farm boy. Same like dust and crops. Not yet. Just like, <laughs> gone too fast, they'd have noticed. Yeah. If they looked in, they would have just saw that nobody was flying, and that wouldn't have been weird at all. They could have at least gotten like Vossler set up front. <laughs> Bothier, your handkerchief. I thought you might want it back. I shall wear it close to my heart. <laughs> Perhaps you forget all that Ondor has wrought. I do not forget, Majesty. It was by his counsel, dangerous though it may have been, that we were able to free you. You must meet with him, Your Highness, and give ear to his words. He may act in league with the Empire, but his heart is not. It is as he says. I ought not have kept Ondor at so great a distance for so long a time. I have played the fool. You were only being cautious. Majesty, I would ask you for some time. On our own, we struggle in vain to restore Dalmasca. I must search out some other way. Until I should find it, I would have Bash remain at your side. Doubt him you may. But I measure his loyalty to Dalmasca no less than my own. I know you would not speak so lightly. Very well. Keep her well. Go to Ondor and there await my return. Hmm, all right. So where does that mean we should go? for the now. I'm gonna save since that was a bit of a trial. It wasn't too bad, but it's just, God, the onslaught of troops is slightly annoying. 
I'm gonna go ahead and do this because I believe this is just gonna be a little story bit, but after that I don't remember quite where it puts us. I don't think I'm gonna do anything huge, but we'll, we'll see where this goes. Hello. His Excellency has given orders that you are to be granted an audience. You are prepared? Yes. When Vossler learned my father had been killed the night of the treaty signing, he returned to Ravenaster, there to aid my escape. There was still time before Vane's reach extended too far. We thought that you could protect me. However, when I then made the announcement that you had taken your own life, I must have seemed a model citizen of the Empire. The announcement, you see, was Vane's suggestion. Of course, at the time I was reluctant, but I could not perceive his reasons. Now it is clear he meant to drive a wedge between us. Halim, we are past all this. Bushirba must stand with us. We can stop Bane. <sighs> I once knew a girl whose only wish was to be carried in her uncle's arms. Your Majesty is a woman grown now. Then Bushirba will aid me. Suppose for a moment you were to defeat Vane. What then? You cannot simply rebuild your kingdom with the only proof of your birthright stolen. Without that, the Grand Kiltias on Boomises cannot and will not recognize your Majesty as the rightful heir. You may yet be a princess, but without proof of your identity, you are powerless. You will remain with me. We do nothing till the time is right. I cannot just wait. Then what does your majesty propose we do? Uh, Uncle Halim. Incidentally, what is the going rate for rescuing princesses these days? Food would be a start. The good stuff, mind you. This can be arranged, <laughs> though it will take some time. Time enough for a bath, I hope. Dirty business, you know. Ah, best bring a change of clothes, too. He's not gonna use them. We all know video game characters don't change. Unless you have costume options. What are you doing? This is Balthier's ship. I'm going to retrieve the Dawn Shard. It's the proof that I need. I know where it's hidden. I'll return his airship later. Are you crazy? This is something that I have to do. Not only for myself, but for all those who have fallen. I will not be made to hide. I'll fight alone if I must. You still have Bosch, right? Besides, you can't just go around stealing people's ships. What are you trying to do? I'm trying to concentrate. That's quite enough, Your Majesty. What, what do you think? think? A, A bit, bit over the top. top. In my line of work, you never know when something like this might come in handy. I'm, I'm trying, trying to, to concentrate. concentrate. Ooh, that's weird. Also thief, yeah, no kidding. I'm leaving you with a Marquis. You can't! Trust me, you're better off staying here. Suppose you kidnapped me instead. You're a sky pirate, aren't you? Then steal me. Is that so much to ask? What do you have that I would want? The Dynast King's treasure. The Dawn Shard is but one of the riches that lie waiting in King Wraithwall's tomb. <whistles> King Wraithwall, you say? Kidnapping royalty is a serious offense. It won't do much to lower the bounty on your head. How much is the price on your head these days, I wonder? Allow me to escort you in Vossler's place. Will you be joining us? What? 
Are you kidding? I don't want to stick around this place. Then I'm coming too. Canelo. Don't leave me here. <sighs> of course not. Then it's settled. We should leave before the Marquis realizes she's missing, like proper kidnappers. There's a reason also. Two best characters, Vaughn and Pinello, yay. You know they get their own game later on. If they were planning that all along, maybe we shouldn't have. Well. Best not dwell on it. Dr. Sid, does this set Draclaw? I have confirmed he receives funds from Lord Vane. His agency in the fall of Nabudis is also certain. Yet, with Judge Zekt, who led the assault, missing, the truth remains difficult to ascertain. The long, cold years have clouded my eyes. I cannot see my own son's heart. <laughs> <coughs> My lord. This illness will claim me. So then, who is to be my successor? The Senate fears the capable Peregrine Vane. They prefer a young fledgling emperor. Gabranth. Once in the past, I laid siege to your homeland. The Republic of Landis is long since gone. My allegiance lies wholly with the Empire. Perhaps. But what of your brother? He did not accept us as you did. He fled to Dalmasca. Did you never think to follow him? I follow his every move. He is an enemy of the Empire. He will be cut down. So you would kill even your own brother for the Empire. Be that as it may, Gebranth. Your ruthlessness is not without merit. But it must not become this way with Larsa. You must ensure that it does not. So then you ask me to be his sword, to strike where he might not. Rather be his shield. Gabranth, keep your close watch on Vane. His is the keenest blade of all. My lord. Do this for me, Gabranth. I could not... I could not bear to see my sons... <laughs> war with each other again. <clears throat> yes, badass stride. You're talking about when Gobranth was like marching on up there. He's got a certain presence, doesn't he? This come in handy often? It's tough being popular. Wouldn't want any admirers dropping in while we're away. Well now, that's as far as she goes. We'll be in Yacht from here onwards. Across the Sand Sea, to the Valley of the Dead, and to King Wraithwall's tomb below. So when you're in Yacht, Sky Stones don't work at all. That's why we gotta hoof it the rest of the way, you see? Happy you get to teach me something for a change? Well, if you want to be a Sky Pirate, you gotta know your... Hey, what do you mean for a change? Come on, At least we thought it. to bring I'm entertainment. Oh, yeah? 
Says who? You want to see what they think about it? I wouldn't be so confident. <laughs> Okay, well, I'm glad we got that out of the way. This one sort of opens up here. Let's take that one. Well, okay. Hold on. Are you one of those map moogles? No, no. Don't you worry about the straw, Koopa. I'll keep an eye on her. No, wait. Both eyes. Oh, yeah, he's one of the maintenance crew. Desert Merchant. I don't suppose you guys are part of the Cartographer's Guild, are you? Don't let the desert sun get the best of you. If you're low on supplies, now's the time to stock up. Very true words, however, I do not have much money right now. I'm looking to change that. Okay. If you're westward bound, travel lightly, boy. Uh. <laughs> not all the races you'll meet in the Sand Sea are the civilized variety. And mind the weather. Nice clear days, the elements come out in droves. Don't want my customers dying, bad for business. I know she's got short hair, but still. Uh, so yeah, anyway, this is sort of where it opens up just a bit. Uh, we're not gonna be dealing with stuff so linear. Although there is a clear destination in mind, I don't know how far away it is. But eventually, um, we'll need to get to another dungeon. Uh, I remember this other one being quite big, so I'm sure that'll be fun. Uh, the desert here in the Western Sand is pretty big, and you can sort of roam around a bit, and I think you can even go back to uh, Rabinaster. Let's take a look. Yes, we can. Okay, I thought it might open up another map to see uh, if we could transport to the gates, but that's fine. Oh, hey, and Bond's just put back in charge. Well, I guess we're not in a combat situation, that's probably why. Anyway, uh, yeah, so since this opened up a little bit, I might do a little bit of grinding in my own time, maybe do some hunts, some stuff to try to get the money back up, just because we've got a hell of a lot of party members now. Is this all the characters? It might be. I don't remember the full cast. Six. Hmm. Maybe. I know there's a lot of guest characters that come in and out, but I don't remember the, everybody that was in this game. I think that might be it, though. So, well, six is a nice round number. We get a little bit of backstory for everybody, or at least some personality and development, so that's good. Keep it tight and concise. But yeah, anyway, uh, this is a good opportunity for me to do some stuff. Some of the more boring, grindy things on my own, and then we'll come back to this uh, probably in a couple days. Next stream's gonna be Okami, as usual, but um, we will be back with, with Final Fantasy 12 Zodiac Age in a bit. Oh, that just exit the entire game. That's fine. Well, that's gonna be it for me, so thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Um, let me try to pull up my. Where the hell is that? Oh, it's on the other monitor. That's right. Let's see, it was just hiding behind every other program that was on the other monitor. Uh, Helmeth, thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. And yeah, hopefully I'll be back tomorrow. We'll do some Okami and come back to this in a couple days. So until then, everybody take care. Have a good night. See you next time.